Hello there. All right, so I'm making this video on how a Dutch auction works because I can't freaking find a decent video on the internet that shows how an actual Dutch auction works um, on the screen. So here we go. Um, okay, so how does this thing work? So a Dutch auction start, this thing started this morning at uh, uh, 11 a.m. EST at 3 ETH. And then every uh, 10 minutes, it dropped 0 0.028. So what that means is right now, uh, 5117 out of 10,000 were minted. So that means if we do the math, that means there's 4,883 NFTs remaining to be minted at this current price of 1768 ETH for the next seven minutes. So imagine this price is frozen in time for the next seven minutes. Um, and you could download or you could mint up to 4,800 of them all right now at this frozen price. When this timer ends, this price will drop by 0 0.028 and however many is left is however many you can mint at that next um, increment on price. And this will basically keep going until, um, this will basically keep going until it comes to there's zero left or you know 10,000 out of 10,000 or like how this video or how this um, statement goes um, or until it hits one and just stops. So whichever comes first, that's the, the parameters or that's this, the distinction with this one. So right now you can see it's 5117. If I hit refresh, you can see it's 5119. So what happened is um, two people or two NFTs were minted at this price while this timer is still on. Um, yeah, and that's how it works. Like, um, it was so freaking confusing before on this Dutch auction and never knew how it worked. But basically, you know, this is the price that it's at and you can mint it at this. So if you pit, press this button now, you can go ahead and mint um, at that price of 1.768. So 1.768. So um, it's like, the price sticks until the time changes and the price goes down. So there you go. Quick explanation on how a Dutch auction works.